Here's another sample problem about hydrostatic force on plane surfaces. So here's the problem. For an 8 feet length of gate EB in the figure shown, find the compression in strut CD due to water pressure. Take note, B, C, and D are leads. Okay, 8 feet is the length of the gate perpendicular to the screen. Okay. So therefore, um, the dimension of the gate is 6 feet high, 8 feet wide, or 8, to 8 feet long. Now, the height of the gate is 6 feet. So, this is the center of gravity okay. so first we determine the magnitude of the hydrostatic force which is located at or f is acting at the center of pressure okay so again the formula is gamma specific weight of water and H bar and then area, times area. So this is H bar. And the value of this is, the angle is 60, therefore the, ang the value of H bar is two feet plus this distance. And since this angle is 60 degrees, this distance is hypotenuse three feet sine of 60 so 3 sine 60 money and vertical distance plus 2 feet that's the value of h bar and this is equal to 4.598 so after this then we cannot solve for the hydrostatic force Gamma of water in English units is 62.4 pounds per cubic feet times H bar. The area is 48 or simply 6 by 8, 8 feet long. So feet, 10 feet square, that's feet cube. Ma cancel sa feet cube. So the unit of F is pounds. The magnitude is 13,771.93 pounds. Ah. Next is we solve for E, eccentricity. No? This is the center of gravity and this is the center of pressure. So we solve for E so that we can determine the distance of F from B. Can the range of rotate? So, we need the value of the force of strat CD para dili mag-collapse ang, ang heat. No? Due to this force if pag dili kaya sa CD and marotate ni siya clockwise. No? So, we'll solve for the compression in strat CD. Okay. Solving for E, the formula is I sub G over area times Y bar. Uh, we use the formula of I sub rectangle 1 over 12 VH cube. And for Y bar, this one, 60 degrees minus 60 degrees. And again, Y bar is equal to H bar over sine of angle. And H bar of sine over sine of 60. And the value is 5.31. So 4.598 divided by sine 60 is 5.31. So <clears throat> I is 1 over 12. The base is 8. The height is 6. The area is 48. 
six times eight, and then y bar five point three one. It's point five six five feet. So after a, we cannot solve for d. And d from the figure shown, d is equal to three feet minus e. So three minus e d is two point four three five. Okay, so now we will now sum up moment about P sign convention counterclockwise positive. So F times D and then um, the force in strat C D since it is inclined, we will resolve the force into a component. So <clears throat> this is the compression of um, or force in strat C D. And to resolve the components, we have this one, and then this for this component perpendicular sa width. Now only this component will produce moment, and since this angle is forty-five degrees, then this component is FCD sine of forty-five, and the distance of this force from B is three feet. So summing up moment, the moment of F is negative clockwise. While the moment of F C D sine 45 is counterclockwise. So this is the equation. F sub C D sine 45 times distance three minus hydrostatic force F times distance B. And substituting the values of F and D, we now have this equation. So next step is transpose these terms, right? And then divide it by the coefficient of FCD, this one. And then compute the value of the force in strat CD is equal to 15,808.38 pounds. Okay. So, that's it. So I hope that you have learned something. And again, thank you for watching.